Hello there, and welcome to another impressive episode on managing iPhones at Wondershare Dr. Phone's official channel. It's your favorite host, Francisco, and today we're going to bring to you a very unique issue involving iPhone security. Now, in this video, we're going to provide you with some basic methods and ideas on how to unlock an iPhone without a passcode or face ID if it's forgotten or malfunctioning, respectively. But before that, do make sure that you subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon for all the latest updates. Now, with that said, let's go ahead and dive right in. Part 1. Best Ways to Unlock iPhone Without a Passcode or Face ID So starting with unlocking your iPhone without a passcode or a face ID, multiple techniques are available to aid in this scenario. Provided next are going to be 4 unique techniques that will be able to get you to the home screen of your iPhone without inserting a passcode or face ID. Number 1 is going to be to unlock it via Find My. The Find My service is an appropriate source for unlocking an iPhone if it is inaccessible. Although you are unaware of your iPhone's passcode and have an inoperable face ID, it is essential to remember the Apple ID credentials for this solution. To make this work, look through the steps provided next and unlock your iPhone. But keep in mind that it erases all assorted data from the device as well. So use the web browser on any device and log on to the iCloud website with your Apple ID, then tap on the grid icon from the top right corner of the screen and choose the Find My feature of iCloud. Next, just go ahead and choose your locked iPhone from the All Devices panel present on the left side and tap the Erase This Device button. A new pop-up will appear on the screen and then proceed to have you press the Next button. Afterward, confirm the process by following the on-screen instructions. Number two is going to be via iTunes. So you all might remember iTunes as your music management service, yet a lot has actually changed ever since iTunes not only offers services for managing the iPhone's music, but also has dedicated options for managing entire iPhone devices. This can be observed in the Restore option, present within iTunes that installs an entirely new firmware on your device. It comes at the disposal of losing your important data. So to know how iTunes is used perfectly for unlocking your locked iPhone, look ahead. Connect your locked iPhone with your device using the Apple certified Lightning or USB-C cable and follow these instructions to enable the recovery mode. For iPhone 8 or above, start by pressing and releasing the volume up button and do the same with the volume down button. Then press and hold the power button for a few seconds until recovery mode is activated. For iPhone 7 and 7 Plus, you have to press and hold the power and volume down buttons together to enable recovery mode iPhone 6s and below, so for older iPhone models, press and hold the power and home button together until the recovery mode screen finally appears. Once the iPhone is in recovery mode, you will get a pop-up on your iTunes screen stating that there is a problem with your iPhone and that it should be restored or updated. So to remove the iPhone passcode, press the restore button and wait for iTunes to install the new firmware on your iPhone. Number three is going to be using the forgot passcode feature. Another simple technique of unlocking your iPhone without a passcode or face ID is through the forgot passcode option. Instead of involving another device in the process, all you need to add is your Apple ID, which will be processed accordingly. So to know how it is done properly, learn the steps featured next coming right up. Tap the forgot passcode option from the bottom right corner of the locked iPhone screen and press the start iPhone reset button. Next, you will be asked to provide your Apple ID details to confirm the reset procedure. Your locked iPhone will automatically reset once you provide the correct Apple ID and password. So just as a quick note, this feature can also help you save your iDevice data if you try it within 72 hours since your iPhone passcode got changed. Number four is going to be through Wondershare Dr. Phone Screen Unlock. The methods discussed before looked very promising, I would say. However, there's always a little room that restricts its overall execution. Meanwhile, some of the methods might actually look a little bit complicated for beginner level users, which is why there is a need for an option that suits all users perfectly. Wondershare Dr. Phone is a renowned iOS management service with dedicated features for controlling your iPhone. If you seek to unlock your iPhone screen using Wondershare Dr. Phone, the process is executed within a few clicks. Furthermore, its hefty compatibility with different devices makes it a versatile option. Provided next are going to be the simple steps that can be practiced to unlock your iPhone with the help of, of Dr. Phone Screen Unlock. Start by installing the latest version of Wondershare Dr. Phone on your Windows PC or MacBook. Afterwards, open the Toolbox tab and choose the Screen Unlock tool. From the Device Type screen, choose the iOS option and proceed with the Unlock iOS screen feature. To initiate the iDevice passcode removal process, press the Start button and put it in recovery mode using the on-screen instructions. This will enable Wondershare Dr. Phone to detect your iPhone model and suggest possible firmware versions for it. 
So choose the one that you need and press the start button to let this iPhone screen unlock tool download and verify the firmware. Once the firmware process is completed, click the unlock now button to remove the iPhone passcode successfully. Part 2. How to turn off passcode or face ID on my iDevice. The iPhone passcode and face ID can malfunction in a similar condition that is being discussed throughout this video and can cause you great stress. In such cases, it is best to turn off your passcode or face ID on your iDevice if you feel that there is no need to perform any extra protection exercises. So follow the simple steps offered next, which will help you turn off these security features on your iPhone. From the home screen of your iPhone, access the iPhone settings app and tap the face ID and passcode settings. Following this, you will have to provide your iPhone passcode to access the settings. Once you're inside the settings, disable the face ID across all options, especially iPhone unlock. To turn off the iPhone passcode, just scroll down and choose the turn passcode off option. Next, provide your iPhone passcode. For To answer this question, you need to understand how the face ID technology works in an Apple device. Pass my iPhone face ID with a picture. To answer this question, you need to understand how the Face ID technology works in an Apple device. The technology does not capture a simple picture to unlock the device, but uses advanced technology that puts a filter across an entire face. Following this, a 3D contour is developed with basic assumptions about the individual's lighting condition and overall facial look. Using this technology, the iPhone gets unlocked, which clarifies that bypassing your device's Face ID through a picture is nearly impossible, and it only offers a 2D experience rather than the 3D experience experience that you're required to have. So this brings us to the end of the video about unlocking iPhones without a passcode or face ID. We do hope that this guide has helped provide you with some proper methods that can be used to unlock a device properly. Although you might have to lose hold of your data in this process, finding the one that makes operations easy is the most preferable. In this case, Wondershirt Dr. Phone has become a game-changing method for unlocking iPhones. So as we come to an end, do give us a like and comment below any of your thoughts on what you feel after watching this video. Also, subscribe to our channel for more content just like this. And until next time, have a good one and enjoy.